Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to explain and practically demonstrate one of the Selenium exception types that generally occur during Selenium automation. That is element not interactable exception. So let's get started. In this session, I'll show you different situations where you may paste this exception in a practical manner. For that, I'll open this Eclipse ID where we have the sample Java project already configured with Selenium. And here we have the sample class and inside that we have the main method and some sample automation code, which is already written for opening the Chrome browser and maximizing the browser. Now let me write the automation code for showing you the different situations where you can get this element not interactable exception. First, I'll take this application URL that is tutorialsninja.com slash demo application. I'll go to this login page. Okay, here, as you can see on the login page, there is a login form. Let me inspect one of this element here. Okay, so into this email address, I can enter the text, right? So here, I inspected this email address and this is HTML code. If I give this ID of this email address and locate this and try to enter the text into this email address field, everything will work. But what if I try to enter the text into this form? Can we enter a text into this form? We can enter the text into this input field, but we cannot type text into this form. So let's see what will happen if you try to enter some text into this form. So I'll create a locator for this. Okay. So here I'll first say driver dot get. And here I'll give this URL to go to this page. After that, I'll give the XPath expression for finding this form and trying to enter the text into this form. Okay. So driver dot find element by dot XPath and uh, dot send keys I will give. I'll try to type my name okay into this element but here what is the xpath i am going to give i am going to give the xpath of this form can we enter text into this form no right but what will happen if you try control f here control f so here action is there copy this url guys okay copy this url double slash form at the rate action is equal to give that okay enter okay so here you see this is a form i have located what will happen if you try to enter text into the form, you will get an exception. Okay. Here I gave the XPath case of that form. Okay. Now, if I run this code, I'll get exception that is element not interactable exception. So, when you try to enter text into the elements where it is possible to enter, then you'll not get exception. But if you try to enter text into the form tag, something like that, you'll get exception for sure. Right. So, here we got element not actable exception. Now, let me show you another example where you can get this element not interactable exception. Let's say I'll try to enter text into this label. Can anyone enter the text into this label? No, right? But what will happen if you try to enter the text into this label? Only text box fields we can enter, but I will try to enter text into this text label. Okay, so inspect this. And uh, okay, this is not here. I'll inspect here. Inspect this heading. And uh, this is the HTML code, guys. Okay. So I'll copy this text here. I'll create an XPath for that. Double slash H2. Text is equal to the text of that heading. Okay. You see, this XPath expression is locating this return customers. Okay. Returning customers. You see, this is one it's locating. So I'll try to enter text into this label, which is not possible. Right. But what will happen? You will get exception known as element not interactable exception. Okay, driver dot find element by dot xpath. So dot send keys and I'll type my name here. Okay, so I'm trying to enter text into a label which is not possible and this will result in element not interactable exception. So in the first case, I was showing you how to, like in the first case, I was showing you when I try to enter text into a form tag, I got the exception. Same exception you will get, you try to enter text into a label, okay? So go here and see, you got element not interactable exception. So 
these are the two examples i gave two more examples i'll give guys okay for that i will take another application url so i'll take driver dot get i'll take you to this application url and show you other two examples where you can get this uh, element not interactable exception i'll take you here to this application page so here guys i want to enter the text into this text box field this time everything is fine i am not entering text into the form or i am not entering the text into the label i am choosing a proper field where i am trying to enter text into this text box field inspect this text box field and this is a html right so here there is a class okay i'll take this class copy this i am taking the class as a locator and uh, here first of all let me give the url guys let me give the url of this application and after that i'll say driver dot find element by dot class name i'll give the class locator okay i'll give the class locator for this and find this text box field, okay so then i'll say send keys so this case also you are going to get element not interactable exception i'll tell you the reason okay though we are giving everything fine here there is a reason why that exception will come run this code I'm trying to type my name into the text box field, but instead of my name typed into the text box field, I'm going, you see the, my name is not typed into the text box field, but I will be getting this exception known as element not interactable exception. But what happened here? Why we got this? Here it is a text box field, right? What happened was, if you carefully observe this HTML code, okay, so there are two elements. First is TD having the same class, value gsc input you see this input field is also having the same class that is gsc hyphen input okay so we thought that while trying to type text into the text box field while trying to locate this text box field we thought that using this class locator we we thought that this text box field is getting located but what's happening internally was it was locating this one instead of this uh, text box field it was trying to type text into the td tag which is not possible that's why we got element not interactable exception here okay now one more example i'll show you guys this is a very important example so i'll take the same application so what i want to do here is on this application page somewhere here there is a hidden button okay that button you are not able to see here if i inspect this label and below this label there is a button guys if i expand this you see this is a input okay so it has some hidden attribute. If I remove the hidden attribute, the button is coming, you see. But again, if I refresh this page, if I refresh the page here, you see again hidden attribute is coming back and the button is hidden, guys, okay? What if I try to click on a button which is uh, there in the DOM, but it's not visible on the page, okay? With this ID, ID of the hidden button, guys, which is there in the DOM, but it's not visible on the page. So in this case also, you'll get element not interactable exception find element by dot id id of the hidden button or hidden element which is not visible on the page but there in the dom if i try to click on that button which is not visible on the page but there in the dom whose html code is there in the dom then i'm going to get the same exception that is element not interactable exception this is the last example guys till now i gave three examples this is the fourth example in which you will be getting element not interactable exception okay it will try to click on the hidden button but it will not be there visible on the page and hence you will be getting this exception known as element not interactable exception so there may be different situations where you will get this element not interactable exception apart from the different examples i have shown in this session okay but these are the important ones whatever i covered so that's it guys thank you bye